Hi there, I'm Dr. Yossi from Vita Lab, and this month for Endometriosis Awareness Month, we're going to shoot a short video, informative video about endometriosis. What does it mean? Who should get checked out for endometriosis, and how should endometriosis be treated? So, women with endometriosis primarily present to us with painful periods, painful or heavy periods, and it's usually a pain that's associated with the feeling of the period starting. So women will say, I get pain before I see my period starting. It's quite normal for a woman to have some pain when she gets her period, but to have this pain before the period starts is quite classical of women with endometriosis. Women with endometriosis also complain of painful periods, and we also have this chronic pelvic discomfort that they complain of. So you shouldn't know that your uterus and your ovaries are there all the time. And women with endometriosis tend to have this feeling of discomfort, which kind of hovers around them through the month. They may have pain only with their periods. Some women also present with pain around ovulation. So they get a dis serious discomfort at the time that they're ovulating. And then other women also may present with spotting before their periods or in a few days after their periods. So the presentation is quite broad, but that is primarily what women present with. The other symptoms that we see with endometriosis are pain with intercourse, pain with passing stools. We often see women complaining that their bowels change significantly around their periods. They either become very constipated or they get very bad diarrhea. And um, also sometimes complain of bladder discomfort around their periods. The pain with intercourse, again, is not classic, but we primarily find women complaining of pain with deep penetration and certain positions which causes discomfort. And we often find that the pain is cyclical, so it gets worse as a woman gets closer to her period.